North Carolina is becoming known as a hot spot for wine, for beer, and now spirits. But one company is gaining a following for creating something that's often associated with another state. I found out why their bourbon is carving out a place of its own, all because of the way it's made in North Carolina. You can't rush perfection. It just takes time. The folks at Southern Distilling in Statesville have built quite a reputation on that. And that might have surprised a lot of the competition. We won the 22 New York World Wine and Spirits Best Bourbon overall, which is kind of our Super Bowl. I think it's the first and only time that a non-Kentucky brand has done that. It's amazing that that was done by a little North Carolina distillery that most people have never heard of. Yeah, people have heard of them now. This family-run business is now more than a decade old, and plenty of consumers have sampled their wares without even knowing it. But the biggest part of our business is we're a contract producer for a lot of other brands around the country and around the world. So we produce for about 140 different clients at this point. And that's really the thing that kind of pays the mortgage, so to speak, and, and uh, you know, keeps us moving forward. Southern Distilling likes to let people see behind the scenes, encouraging them to visit the business just off I-77. You learn about what it takes to turn out bourbon, rye, and even a special cream liqueur called Double Shot. Or visit the Rick House to see the barrels stacked carefully, letting the spirits inside gracefully transform into top shelf bourbon. And you learn why local farmers are so important, because they help supply one of the main ingredients. We run through about 60,000 pounds of grain every single day that is grown within 15 to 20 miles of this facility. And there's really no other uh, producer in the country that can say that. North Carolina agriculture continues to grow because businesses like Southern Distilling keep investing in the local growers around them. It's a real commitment because when they succeed, all those other families succeed too. They also got a moment in the spotlight at the Wyndham Championship with Southern Star named the official bourbon of the PGA event. Lots of fans had a chance to stop in their tasting room and sample some of the best Southern Star cocktails. To be right in the middle of such a major tournament is pretty special. It's a, a top tier PGA event. It's the last, uh, the, the last tournament before they go into the championships. Um, what better place to be seeing, you know, than that venue? And I can tell you it was just a fantastic experience for us as a company. Southern Distilling is now one of the largest privately owned distilleries in the country. And while it's great to be busy making products for others, they've still got big plans for the one that means the most to them. But we want the branded side, the Southern Star side of the business, to really take the lead at some point. But you have to be patient. You know, there are no overnight successes in this business. Yep, it does take time, years of slow aging and years of experience. But the folks behind Southern Star know the result in every bottle is really worth it. Well, you can find Southern Star products at ABC stores all across the state. But it's always worth a trip to the distillery. Learn more about the brand. They're just off I-77 in Statesville. Or look them up online at Southern Distilling.